Good day everyone, this is Alvin Pinupal and welcome again to my YouTube channel. Yay! Alright, so hindi na natin ba tatagalin pa? Ang video natin ngayon is all about how to compute your general weighted average sa college. Alright, so handa na ba kayo? Dahil ako, handa na ako. Alright, so hindi na natin patatagay pa. Wala nang patumpik-tumpik pa. Boom, yaka-yaka. So let's get started. But before anything else, before mo makompute yung GWA or General Weighted Average mo, make sure na meron ka ito. So pinaghandaan ko na po ito siya. So dapat may subject ka, of course. Then dapat mo din kunin o alamin yung units in every subject na kinuha mo and then of course your grades alright so just like for example uh, ito yung mga subject na kunyari kinuha ko alright so first one is the elementary calculus the next one is understanding the self for purposive communication environmental science mathematics in the modern mathematics in the modern world PE or fitness then CWTS alright and then Yung units ng elementary calculus is 3, understanding the self is 2, purposive communication is 3, environmental science is 3, math and modern, mathematics in modern world is 3, then fit, fit, fitness is uh, 2, then CWTS is 3. Then ito po yung mga grades niya, oh, di ba? Ang lalaki, sana all. So sa elementary calculus may 2.0 ka na grades. Dahil medyo mahirap talaga ito elementary calculus. Buti na lang makados. <laughs> Sana all makados. Understanding the self which is 1.25. 1.75 naman sa purpose of communication. 1.50 naman sa environmental science. 175 sa mathematics and modern world. And 1.0 both Fed and CWTS. So without further ado, i-compute na natin ito. But of course, kinakailangan natin ng cell phone. Wait lang. Para calculator natin. Gagamitin natin itong calculator. Hindi naman kasi ako magaling sa mathematics. Kaya ano ba ito? ito? Ayan. So, ang una lang natin gawin is i-multiply natin yung grades natin sa number of units. So, for example, 2 times 3 equals 6. 6.0 1.25 times 2 is equals to 2.5 and then 1.75 times 3 is 5.25 1.5 times 3 equals 4.5 1.75 times 3 is again 5.25 then 1.2 equals 2.0 and 3.0 ayan so since nakuha mo so ito na yun sila so ang susunod natin gawin is i-add natin ito Alright, so let's go. 6 plus 2.5 plus 5.25 plus 4.5 plus 5.25 plus. And by the way, yung feed fit na sa CWTS is exclusive po siya. So hindi natin siya isasali sa computation. Yes, included. Hindi po siya kasali. So. Ito lang yung ikukompute natin. Okay? So, the answer is 23.5. 23.5. Nakuha nyo ba? Nasundan nyo po ba? Yung fed fit nga sa CWTS ay excluded po. Ayon po sa grading system. Ang next mong gagawin is, i-add mo naman itong number of units. Again, excluding ang fed fitness fitness and CWTS. So, ano na mangyari? 1, 2, 3, 4. 4 times 3 equals 12. Plus 2 equals 14. So, you have a total units of 14. And then, the next mong gagawin is you have to divide this sa number of units mo. So, ang mangyari, 23.5 divided. Hindi na, hindi na lumanan yung pentel pin natin. 14. 23 0.5 divided by 14 is equals to 1.679 in 3 decimal point. So your GWA 
for this semester exam for example is 1.679 Alright, so that's the end of our video. If you want more, just comment down below. God bless everyone.